verse 2. Behold, God is my salvation. These are things you are professing. You will say this, you are praising God. This, this is the subject of your praise. Behold, God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. That is a choice. I will trust and not be afraid for Jehovah, for the Lord Jehovah is my strength and my song he is also become my salvation. So this is the subject of the praise. You are speaking of who God is to you. You are speaking of what God has done for you. It is the subject of your praise. Glory to God. Amen. He is my salvation. I will trust in him. I will not be afraid. He is my strength. He is my song. He has also become my salvation. Glory to God. He has become your deliverance from every trouble. The Bible says that the seed of the righteous is delivered from evil and the wicked falls in, in its place. The seed of the righteous is delivered from evil. Delivered from evil. Hallelujah. And so, <laughs> you face danger or your children face danger. It could even be in the way they are living their lives. You keep declaring the seed of the righteous. Lord, I praise you because the seed of the righteous is delivered from evil. I am delivered from this evil. I'm delivered from this shame. I'm delivered from this reproach. I'm delivered from embarrassment. In the name of Jesus. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Oh, praise the Lord. Then look at what it says in verse 3. Because you have made a choice to praise God. You have made him your song and your salvation. In verses 1 and 2. And I said, therefore... Therefore, therefore, with joy shall you draw water out of the well of salvation. With joy. You see, you are praising God joyfully. And so, with that joy, with that joy, that praiseful joy, it says you will draw water from the well of salvation. I've been in houses that had wells. In Benin here, in Sample, if you want to draw water from the well, you don't jump into the well. You may even lose your life jumping into the well. You take a bill or a bucket or a container. You tie a rope, a rope to it. You throw it, the container or the bucket or bill, into the well. And with the rope, you draw out the well. I mean, you draw the water from the well and fill your vessel or your jerry can or your container, whatever it is, your basin. So the prophet is telling you, as I is telling you, that there is a well of salvation. Salvation is everything that God has done for you in Christ. Everything, not just, just only forgiveness of sins. Forgiveness of sins and deliverance from all the evil that sin brought into the world, which includes sickness and disease, failure, untimely death, is in all the evils. Or just name it all the evils, all the evils, inflection that is going on in Nigeria is an evil. And it tells us that the way to draw water to get that deliverance. Is with joy. So joy is that bill or that bucket or container that you have tied the rope to, which is your faith, your trust in God, and you are throwing it into the well. And every time you are bringing out water, depending on what your need is, if it's health for your body, you go there, you use that bill, joy, joy, joy. And draw out water for your health. Hallelujah. And so joy is very vital for your life. Make yourself joyful. 
is a choice you have to make. Things that are happening in the world will drain your joy. I'm telling you, a lot of things are happening, not only in Nigeria, all over the world. You want to drain your joy. But the path is rejoicing. The path of victory is rejoicing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah.